My dear have asked me what birthday cake I'd like at home. It would have to be chocolate cake. Try and make it yourself at home with a simple recipe. Let's go over to Alice, who's making it now. Thanks, John. Now, with the help of my dear, I'm going to show you how to make your favourite birthday cake at home. Let's go. And using the my dear hand mixer, I'm going to cream together my butter and sugar. You want to make sure that it's really light and pale and fluffy. Next, I'm going to add my eggs one at a time and then mix them in until they're fully incorporated. Now that I've added my eggs, I'm going to add my flour, cocoa powder and baking powder. And then you're going to give that a very good mix. It would have to be chocolate cake. It's not about a carrot cake and all that, it's, it's got to be chocolate. <laughs> so our mixture is currently really thick, so we're going to add some milk to loosen it up a bit. So just make sure it is all fully combined and there's no bits of flour hiding at the bottom and then you can transfer it into your tins. Now that my tins are ready, I'm gonna pop them in the My Dear oven. So those are going to bake for 35 to 40 minutes at 180 degrees fan oven. Yeah, I like, I, yeah, I like to bake, my, my, my kids like baking, so cakes, buns, anything with, that they can put chocolate buttons on or chocolate inside. I'm just going to do a quick clean up and pop everything into the dishwasher. Now I'm going to make my ganache by melting together my butter, cream and chocolate. I'm going to place my bowl over a pan of simmering water and just keep stirring. So everything is fully melted, it smells amazing. And you've got a lovely, glossy ganache, which I'm just going to pop in the fridge. So now the sponges are baked, it's time to get them out of the oven. And then just to check they're baked, stick a knife in and check that it comes out clean. Okay, so now our ganache has burned up nicely in the fridge. I'm going to whip it up a little bit just so it's the perfect consistency for icing my cake. I'm usually away. This will be maybe one that I'll celebrate at home with my family, which will be nice. You want a nice big dollop of ganache and then just use a palette knife to spread it around. Just check that it's all level before you stack each layer. So I'm just going to spread this all over and then smooth it out again. So I've just got my chocolate drip here and I'm going to carefully pipe it around the outside of my cake. So there we go, John Stone's ultimate dream chocolate birthday cake. Why not give it a go at home and see if you can make one like this? It's so delicious. If you're a chocolate fan, you should definitely give this a go at home.